So, hello, my name is Dharma Vanagan and I'm doing a project about storytelling and how that relates to my culture. So, I identify as Mexican and it's very important to me because my family and traditions uh, involve a lot of Mexican traditions. So, I love learning about my culture and I, I represent my culture by doing the traditional things but also related to storytelling because that's how I learned about um, history. Because there are so many different cultures sitting back in thousands of years back that are still told today. So they are a great part of my tradition, of my culture, of the Mexican culture. And if you ask anyone, they will tell you at least one of the stories that it's very common among everyone. It says here that the elders and youth grow, harvest, cook, and share food and stories. And just like the main people, my people too pass down stories, recipes for other generations to also understand. And in that way, the traditions stay alive and we learn about our culture. Uh, so this uh, picture is telling about the Mexican War and its history, reminding me of when my grandfather used to tell me the stories about back then, back in the day when there was a war going on. The people from the time used to gather all their values because the rebeldes or the people in the war used to take all of them. So they used to gather all their valuables and bury them in hidden places such as like in a hole, bury, bury all the golden holes. But then when the people were killed, all that gold and treasure were forgotten. So the people, my grandfather said that they used to put a spell or something like that to like keep the bad people away so they wouldn't take it. But that when they die, the spell was cast there. So long, long ago when people used to find the gold and they had bad intentions, they either die or misfortune fall upon them. So that kind of freaked me out at times, but I was also fascinated that like, if you found good, if you had bad intentions and greedy, then misfortune will fall upon you. But if you want to do good with the fortune that you find, then all that gold will serve to help others. So that was one of the stories that kind of freaked me out, but also taught me that not to be greedy and to, if you have like enough to share, to share it all. So a way to learn a lesson and also learn about my history and a little bit about my culture and beliefs. Storytelling is important because it shows where we come, where we live, and some of the things that our ancestors have been doing and teaching for generations and in hopes of us continuing those traditions and showing and teaching what we learn by storytelling.